Hello everyone, it's Cara. So what I thought I would do today is I thought I would go through the British coins and notes that are currently in circulation within the UK. So what we'll do is we'll start right at the beginning with the smallest coin and then we'll go up in coins after that. So we start with the one pence coin. Now the one pence coin is the smallest amount of money that we have in the UK and is made out of a material called copper. Now this looks very similar to our next coin in line, which is the two pence coin. Now both the 1p and the 2p coin are both made out of copper and look very similar except as you can see the two pence coin is a lot bigger than the, the one pence coin next in line we have the five pence coin now this is actually the, the smallest in size coin that we have in the uk and is ridged on the outside so if you fell it in your pocket it would feel slightly bumpy and this is the same for the 10p coin now as you can see the 10p coin is a lot bigger than the 5p coin and that's how you distinguish them in, in your pocket so if you put your hand in your pocket and you rummaged around and you were looking for a coin if you felt a very small one it's probably a 5p coin and if you felt one a little bit bigger that's ridged on the outside it's probably the 10p one now this is where the coins get a bit funny after this we have the 20p coin which is flat on the outside but has seven ridges around the outside which makes it a little bit of a funny shape and this is the same for the 50 pence coin now again as you can see the 50 pence coin is a little bit bigger than the 20 pence coin but still has those same lines so again if you put your hand in your pocket you would be able to feel which coin it was without taking it out and having to look at it which is great next we have the one pound coin now the one pound coin is actually the most popular coin that we have in the uk it's just recently changed within the last five years it used to be all gold and flat around the outside but now you might not be able to tell in this picture it's very it has the lines similar to the 20 and the 50p coin just got a lot a, little, a lot more next we have the two pound coin now this is the biggest amount of money we have in coin in the uk and as you can see the one pound and the two pound coin look very very similar except they're just different size now after this we have the notes within the uk so they range from five ten 20 and 50 pounds so from the beginning the green notes that we can see here are the five pound notes now as you can see in this picture all of the notes have our queen on the front so every single one has the queen on the front but on the back of these notes we have different people so on the back of the five pound note we have so Winston Churchill, you can't see it on here, but hopefully I'm going to do a follow-up video for this and I will show you some of these nuts. So we have Winston Churchill on the back of the £5 note, and this is the smallest amount of money that we have in note form. And it's always a green colour. The next note we have after this is the £10 note. Now this is always an orange colour. And currently on the back of the £10 note, opposite to the Queen, we have Jane Austen. Um, next, we have the £20 note. So, the £20 note is always a purple colour. Um, as you can see, it has the Queen on the front and on the back, it has a man called J.M.W. Turner. And finally, we have the £50 note, which is, and I'm not sure you will see a £50 note because they're not very popular, but the £50 note is the biggest in size note that we have. It's a red colour and it currently has Matthew Bolton and James Watt on the back. So as you can see, the £50 note is largest in size and the £50 note is the smallest in size. All of these notes, except for the £50 note, are made out of a material called polymer, which feels like plastic. And the £50 note is still made out of paper. So they are all of the British coins and notes that we currently have in circulation. I hope this helps.